on Kai Havertz. Well, he's got great technique when he's shooting from distance, Derek. He's one of those players that strikes the ball so cleanly because he hits it with his laces through the back of the ball, he starts to dip and swerve on the goalkeeper, and that's what makes him so dangerous from shots outside the box. Stay with us on EA TV. And hello to you from Molyneux here in the English West Midlands. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers, and they take on Arsenal. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And running it back. And here's the Wolves lineup. Well, they're going to play with a back five and three up front, which means the midfield two will have a lot of work to do. These two will certainly need to be at their best today in what looks like a 5 2 3 formation. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Declan Rice starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield and rather than use a strike partnership they've gone with just the one player in attack well opposing defences always have to pay attention when Arsenal provide the opposition I say that Stuart based on their wonderful goal scoring record well their attacking play on the road has been second to none it's been inventive, it's been precise and most importantly it's been clinical they really do play with such confidence when they break forward, which I'm sure we'll see again today. Oh, they have it again. Sarabia. On to Jorginho. Jorginho. It's with Erdogan. Wasteful from Arsenal. Cunha. And it's still on. Can he put it in? Oh, his eyes lit up, thinking it was about to be the opener. Well, just the lack of composure. He should score there. Well, what a chance to take the lead, and doesn't he know it? But will they get a better one than that? Jorginho. Martinelli. Jorginho. William Saliba. Ben White. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. White. Declan Rice. It's with Gabriel. Rice with it. Ben White. And they know they need to stop him. A glorious chance, and did just enough defensively. Craig Dawson. Nelson Semedo has it. Lemina. Nuri. And the defensive intervention there. Promising sequence. Lemina. Cunha. Tremendously strong in the tackle. No more time left. That will conclude the first half here at Molyneux.
And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Foul there, free kick awarded. Mateus Cunha and on the ball Sarabia Lemina keeping the ball moving I just couldn't play that decisive ball Jorginho Saka Havertz it's with Erdogan Bukayo Saka Nicely timed tackle. Lemina. Mateus Cunha. Encouraging move from Wolves. But they took care of the situation defensively. Wang Hee Chan. Cunha. He's foiled them on his own. Outside reception, please move it immediately. Thank you. Declan Rice. Jorginho. Marcinelli. Rice. And it's still on for him. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Lemina. And here's Cunha. Here's Lemina. Wang Hee Chan. And tremendous individual skill. Cunha. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Martinelli Havertz on to Jorginho who had no intention of losing out while well, making considerable progress with the ball but the danger averted for now Nuri on to Huang. Ten minutes left for play. Ryan Ait Nuri. Nuri on to Huang. Ryan Ait Nuri. Only five minutes left for play and tension galore with the teams locked together. Pablo Sarabia. Here's Lemina. And very nicely positioned to win it back. Gabriel. It's with Erdogan. Gabriel Martinelli. Declan Rice and forward go Arsenal do they have a late winning goal in their future and the whistle is sounded and these two teams are locked together